welcome back to another episode of Daily Fortnite, your daily podcast about Fortnite. I'm your host, Mikey, a.k.a. Mike Daddy, a.k.a. Magnificent Mikey. And today, Fortnite made a price adjustment. Right now, this price adjustment isn't going to apply to everybody, but it applies enough places, and I know there's listeners in these places, so we will go over it. Upcoming Fortnite pricing alignment in Brazil, Chile, Colombia, Nigeria, Vietnam, and the Philippines in October 2024. Starting October 14th, 2024, we are adjusting the price of V-Bucks and our real money content pack offers in Brazil, Chile, Colombia, Nigeria, Vietnam, and the Philippines. These adjustments are based on economic factors such as inflation and currency of or and currency fluctuations and follow similar adjustments made last year. We plan to make pricing adjustments around the world on a more regular basis to better respond to these economic factors. These changes do not impact Fortnite Crew subscription pricing, but will have an impact on pricing of real money content packs that return in a future rotation. Additionally, prices on some storefronts might differ slightly from the prices indicated below. Check out the updated pricing in the tables below. And, so, and then they, got, they have a table for um, V-Bucks and for content packs uh, for each of these uh, countries and how much it's going to cost. Uh, I'm not going to read through every single one. If you're watching on YouTube, you can see the table there so you can see how the price is going to be adjusted uh, where you're from. Uh, or if you're just listening to this, you can, uh, you know, go to Fortnite.com, go to, uh, yeah, go to Fortnite.com and then go to news tab and you'll find this blog post in there and the, the, uh, table is in there so you can see it for yourself if you, um, want to know exactly how it's changing. Uh, but yeah, there you go. That's, that's the news for today is that uh, they are making a price adjustment in those regions. And then other than that, uh, there, there's not really any news today. Uh, so let's head on over and take a look at how many people are playing this game. Battle Royale has 90,000. Zero Build has 146,000. Reload has 52,000. Reload Zero Build has 26,000. Um, let's see. Survive in Circle. Uh, Fall Guys is has 199. Oh, short, or oh, Fort Shop Prop Hunt, 980. Minor Tycoon, 1,500. Uh, let's see. Autumn Gun Game, 473. Uh, Go Goated Zone Wars, 6,000. Tilted Zone Wars, 3,000. Peace Control, 2v2, 4,500. Murder Mystery, 2,800. Bios Trio Zone Wars, 1,600. And there's a whole lot more. Uh, to be discovered in the Discover tab. So let's go look at quests. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to our weekly. There should be some new weeklies today. All right, here we go. Hit opponents or block hits with a Captain America shield, 15 in total. Eliminate an opponent with a headshot. Just got to do that once. Complete a shadow briefing once. Damage opponents in landmarks. Uh, 500 damage in total. And a search con wait, sh search containers at named locations before taking damage. 10 in total. Okay, these ones are pretty easy, straightforward. Uh, this week... Uh, 
so get in there and do them because you'll easily get them done and, and level up. Uh, yesterday, I, like I said, I, I, I didn't really have any time to play, but I got into creative, got into that XP map, and gained three levels before I went to bed. And I plan on probably doing the same tonight as well. You know, like I said, it's just so easy, and I want to be keeping up my battle pass so that way I can unlock everything up by the end of this season. Alright, so there's the quest. Let's head on over to the item shop and see what's in the item shop today. Okay, our special offers and bundles in here. Uh, Carol G in here. Gear for Festival. The jam tracks. Uh, the car stuff. Midnight Rose bundle still here. Or Boros bundle still here. Uh, and then we have the Honors Emissary Bundle. So this will include Paxton Price Outfit with Honor and Glory Back Bling for 1200 Emissary Blades Pickaxe for 500 Duel at Dawn Wrap for 500 Or it all comes in that bundle for 1500 which is 700 off the total. Uh, let's see here. We got the Robo Rebels bundle. That's got the Rebel outfit with canister carrier back bling for 1,500. The Revolt outfit with uh, board bag back bling for 1,500. The Crossroads pickaxe for 500. The Can Do It wrap for 500. Uh, let's see here. The FNCS Chapter 5 Season 2 items. The uh, FNCS Global Championship 2024 items. Um, Champions Road. This stuff is still the same. Deadpool and Wolverine. Meowtooth. Uh, and then Crystal uh, Molly's Locker Bundle is still here. The Adidas items. Uh, Black Widow. And then today they added in the Weekend bundle which has the weekend combat outfit with exo back bling for 1800 the axe o pickaxe was 500 popular vibe emo is 500 exo six string guitar is 800 exo keys guitar 800 uh, or it's all in the weekend bundle for 3,100, which is 1,300 off the total. Oops. And then there's the title vibes pack for 1,200. Uh, and there is the boardwalk warriors pack. This has a riptide raz, cubic thorn back bling, unstuffed guff. Uh, stuffed Gluff, uh, Sea Scavenger Stash, Satchel, Undercover Core for 1,500, and the Chain Cape Back Bling for 1,500. All right, and that looks like everything today. Oh, the Boardwalk Warriors pack, by the way, you can get all that stuff I just mentioned together for 2,400. And now that looks like everything today. You can get any and all these items using code Mikey, M-M-M-I-K-I-E, in the item shop, and some of the proceeds will go to help support the show. All right, if I'm going to give it, you know, our item of the day to someone today or something today, um, hmm. I think I will give it to... Uh, the uh, Paxton Price outfit. Like I said, I like that white and the black together. He just looks serious. He's got some awesome weaponry as part of his lore. So in general, I think this guy looks pretty awesome. So that's definitely going to be my pick. All right, and there is your item shop. Let's head on over and see if there was any comments today. Uh, or on any of the recent episodes, one from N Strang says "cool," <laughs> and one from SM Heart that says "I can't wait for Trio's FNCS." Also, they 
uh, are adding X acts of Champions 3.0. Awesome. Well, thanks for letting me know about that. And yeah, I'm I'm excited for Trio's tournament as well. I think it will um, be enough to make one team uh, retreat. You know? Uh... My goodness, just had a little brain fart. Oh, well, well, <laughs> I really just all of a sudden, I forgot what I, I was saying here. Um, oh, yeah, the Trios FNCS. Yes, I'm excited for the Trios FNCS because... Um, yeah, it should make it for some fun competition, a new style of competition from what we what we've been used to seeing in the FNCS, um, and uh, yeah, I I think I think it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of fun. <laughs> okay, um, my goodness, I, I told you the last few days <laughs> at work have just been brutally long. Uh, and hard, so I started to, <laughs> I, I guess my brain started to fall asleep there, I don't know. Uh, but anyways, uh, there's the comments on that, uh, doesn't look like there's any comments over on YouTube, so yeah, that is going to be the episode for today, so make sure you go join the Daily Fortnite Discord and hang out with us, follow me over on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube, head over to Apple Podcasts, leave a five-star rating and a written review for a shout-out on the show, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss an episode, and until next time, have fun, be safe, and don't get lost in the storm. <laughs>